Hello, this is Chris Menard. Let me show you how to quickly put in time in Microsoft Excel. And I'm going to teach you three functions doing this. So you can start Excel from scratch. Name in A1, time in in B1. I don't care if you make them bold or not, but act like you have a lot of names listed. The issue is, and you can just watch me do this part, if I do 7 a.m., it'll put in 7 a.m. I didn't format it to do that. It just knew because of the A. 1 space P will do 1 p.m. 2 space P is 2 p.m. But the problem is this. When I start having to type a colon, I already don't type fast. So typing a colon just really slows me down. So I'm going to highlight all this, delete it. So step one, highlight the range where you're going to type in time, and go ahead and make it text. What that'll do is if I do 0700, if it was a number, it would lose that leading zero. But because it's text, it's going to keep it in here. 1300, 1325, and one more. Now, here's the first function to teach you is the left function. The left function says, what cell reference do you want me to pull from? Is B2, comma 2. That should give me 0, 07 because I pulled two characters starting on the left. Autofill that down. Great. It works. The other function, I could do the right function, but I want to show you the mid function. Equals MID, still pulling from B2, comma. But notice in bold it says start number. So the mid function says what character do you want me to start from? So I'm trying to get the last two characters out. So it's the third character, comma 2. That should give me 0, 0. Crosshairs, autofill down, I should get 25 as the third one, perfect, 55 and 15. So there is your mid function. So step one was to make it text in column B. We did that. You also have to always type in four numbers as military time. But now it's time to convert it. I'm going to do another function called time value. And notice it says it converts a text time. And I'm going to convert left B2 comma 2 close it. That'll take that 0, 07 and make it into a number which I can convert to time. And then I'm going to join to that quotations. There's my colon quotations. So what I'm saying is I'm going to put in 0, 07 and then a colon. The quotations are your text. The quotations will not show up. And then I'm also going to join, there's that mid function, B2, comma, 3, comma, 2. And then just simply close this. And so it's going to take 0, 7. It's going to put a colon in. And then it's going to take the 0, 0. But because it's time value, it's going to convert it to a decimal, and that's perfect. Just so you know this, I always explain this in my Excel Intermediate Training class. Time and dates are actually numbers. So this is actually perfect right here. Simply right-click, Format Cells, uh, Time, keep it easy. Let's try this one first. Notice my sample. Let's go hit OK. That's perfect. Right click again. Format. You want military. Let's try that one. Hit OK. Perfect. One more time. Let's change this to 2355. That should be 1155. Or actually it's 2355. Yeah. Highlight it again. Right click. Format, there you go. So there is step one, make column B text. Step two, look in cell C2, there's the formula right there. 
and use that formula. And then step three is when you're done, you're going to have percentages. Right click, format cells, time, pick whatever time format out you want. And then the last step, to be honest with you, you would right click and copy, right click, paste, special, and we're going to paste the values and the number format. And then I can delete this now. So there you go.